Time for a ride! Mm. Yeah. Oh, what in the world, Toby? I thought I said this before, but you're not supposed to be riding the Jeep in the house. Sorry, Mom. It was just so much fun, I forgot. Well, Toby, you're a little bit of a daredevil, you know that? Of course I'm a daredevil. I do crazy things sometimes. Well, Toby, do you remember when you first rode this blue jeep? No, tell me the story. Well, it all happened about five years ago when you were a little baby. On the day we got your blue jeep, you and me went to the petting zoo all alone. You loved going to the petting zoo and playing with the animals and their toys. You also liked feeding the giraffe. There were machines at the zoo where you could buy animal food to feed the animals. You loved feeding the giraffe the most. I loved watching you play at the petting zoo. But you were a little bit of a turkey. You would climb up dangerous things. And you would play with a not-so-friendly monkey. I don't know why you always tried playing with that monkey. He was pretty mean. If I would have let you, you would have been climbing up that ladder trying to play with that monkey the entire time. I'd have to distract you and put you in the pen with the cute lamb, horse, and squirrel. While you were trying to eat the animal's grass, guess who showed up? It was Mr. Johnson with his son, Tommy. Tommy was the same age as you, and he had an awesome blue Power Wheels Jeep, even with a license plate with his name on it. Oh, it was a beauty and brand new. Tommy went to go play in the same petting zoo pen that you were in. But instead of eating grass, he rode on the cute little pony. I talked to Mr. Johnson about how nice that Jeep looked. He said that he just bought it last week and it cost him $200. Whew, I told him that's a lot of money to spend on a baby. Yeah, he agreed, but I guess he just loves spoiling his son, Tommy. While we were talking, we didn't notice that you climbed over the fence. Then you snuck right into the brand new Jeep. I heard the engine start and I was like, no, Tommy! But it was too late. You were a wild animal behind the wheel. Mr. Johnson tried to stop you, but you were too fast. Just then, you crashed right into the petting zoo. Oh, Toby. Fortunately, you were all right. My poor little baby. Mr. Johnson was not so happy. He checked on the Jeep and there was a huge scratch right in the front and the horn stopped working. Ooh, you do not want to get Mr. Johnson angry. He was super mad. And guess what? He wanted me to pay for the Jeep. He did not want a Jeep that was damaged. Oh boy. Well, since I'm a princess, I guess I could pay for it. 200 bucks, Whew, that's a lot of money, Toby. You are one expensive baby. Because of your crazy reckless driving, we bought a Jeep and I had to push you all the way home in it. Whoa. I can't believe that's how I bought this blue Jeep. <laughs> well, you mean I bought the blue Jeep. <laughs> yeah, you're right. All Toy Collector fans, when you like more stories about baby Toby, please click like and also please remember to subscribe. 
And in the comment section, you can write down your own ideas for what you would like the stories to be about. Goodbye and have a great day. Sorry, Mon. Mon. Sorry, Mon. It was just so much fun, I forgot. <laughs>